And only on Way 31, remember those federal COVID pandemic loans? Well, billions of dollars dished out to small businesses to help keep them afloat during the shutdowns. Well, a North Alabama woman now admits she swindled taxpayers out of nearly $150,000 in loans she didn't qualify for. Way 31's Matt Kroschel is live for us this afternoon. And Matt, you dug into the grand jury indictment where the government outlines how she did it. Marie, inside the federal courtroom here in Huntsville, Kaylee Harris taking that plea deal, admitting to creating a fake business name to secure those funds. Then she says she sent some of that money to a third party, another person living in Texas, also a big no-no here. The U.S. Attorney's Office uh, telling me, quote, individuals like the defendant took advantage of the program and exploited it for their personal gain. They are continuing to track down people who abuse that program. In the Harris case, she admits that in July of 2020, she lied on that loan application, creating the fake business name, then sending $30,000 of the money she received to another person in Texas. Harris could face up to 10 years in prison because of this felony charge. The sentencing will be uh, happening early next year in February, and the judge will have the final say. Reporting live in downtown Huntsville, Matt Kroschel, Way 31 News.